Hello, my name is Adam Papp. I'm a, an undergraduate student here at IPFW. I'm doing a Bachelor of Arts and Sciences in uh, German Studies, and I plan to graduate in 2013. I would say my most important accomplishment since I've been a student here is uh, winning the DAAD scholarship. It's the, uh, the German Academic Exchange Service, and uh, that was my monthly stipend I won uh, that enabled me to study in Germany. I spent two semesters in, in Freiburg, so the entire academic year there, and it was a pretty competitive scholarship with a uh, a really long application process. I think only about 50 students in, in the entire country got that. So I was pretty proud of that. And uh, also the entire year I spent in Freiburg to, to take classes in the German university with other German students. And uh, I was able to get good grades there. And uh, I think that was a big accomplishment. I think the most important thing a prospective major would, would need to know about German studies is the, the, the amount of writing and reading that goes into it. That's pretty much what you'll spend your entire time with actually in, in classes. Uh, first, you'll learn how to use the language and it's going to be pretty demanding because in the second year you'll probably be reading full novels and, and short stories and uh, that can be pretty difficult if you've only had a year of training. So uh, yeah, I think uh, in order to accomplish that you'll have to take part in all the extracurricular activities such as German club and uh, in all the competitions that take place such as essay writing contests and uh, also just read the textbook in between semesters and I think all that's required if, uh, if you want to have success. I'm really happy I majored in German because of all the opportunities it's giving me. Uh, for example, as I mentioned, the, the ability to study in Germany, uh, that was a great experience there. And uh, I've, I've just really had a good time because I really like foreign languages, so, uh, so I never regretted it. And uh, the ways I used, uh, I've used it in, in uh, practically, I mean in real life, is, uh, for example, I'm doing some, some research now on Hungarian writers and German literature. And I plan to carry that into my future because I want to go to grad school and get a master's degree. And uh, that's kind of like a practical application. It's uh, a credible plan of research that I can do in grad school. And I hope I can apply that as my, my statement of purpose. In the future, I want to finish up my master's degree. And if I'm successful, I want to also get a PhD and then go into academia as a German professor. If it doesn't work out, there are a few other possibilities. I'd like to be a translator or uh, even a school teacher. But as long as I stay in the field, I'll be happy.